Hi, I'm Matt. This is Ruth. We're with AFX Ankle Foot Maximizer and we wanted to take some time today to tell you a little bit more about our product. Uh, to start out with, before we built anything, the first thing we did is we went to practitioners and asked, what don't you like about foot and ankle rehab? And resoundingly it came back that you spend all your time tying and retying rubber bands and repositioning the patient, that it's complex, it's confusing, and ultimately it doesn't work because most of the time you're focused on whether or not the band is going to slide off and hit someone in the face. So AFX addresses those problems and is a more effective strengthening tool. To start out with, what I have in my hand here is a flex, is what we call our foot support and it's very flexible so with every movement of the foot you can flex and engage those muscles of the foot. As well you'll notice on here there's a bump that goes under the knuckle of the big toe to line the foot up properly in the foot support as well as provide a little bit more grip. Now as well you'll notice that this is closed cell neoprene so it's nice and easy to clean uh, and if they need to in a clinic setting you can just pop it off throw it into the washing machine and as well you'll notice this is actually how you change the resistance it's very easy to change up to all the different levels of resistance so I'll just get Ruth to strap in here now you'll notice it's nice and easy you're not sitting there having to worry about if the band is too tight not tight enough and the like and your athlete the straps and away you go heel on the floor and I'll get uh, first of all I'll just get Ruth to do nice toe flexion and you'll notice as she's doing toe flexion that there's resistance that goes to both the toes and to the midfoot the resistance going to the toes is two-thirds of that which goes to the midfoot corresponding to the optimal strength ratio of toe flexion to plantar flexion and it's that way with all different levels of resistance that come with AFX so Ruth is doing toe flexion and plantar flexion but now she's doing inversion toe flexion plantar flexion and the E version as well. And that's why the mid bar is there, is to facilitate the lateral movements. And that's obviously chronic uh, with ankle sprains and everything else, is that people tend not to have that lateral strength. Uh, now I'll get Ruth to do uh, isolated E version. So a nice little flex to the foot. You'll notice you put the handle outside the non-exercising knee, slight flex to the foot, away you go. And now we'll get her to do inversion as well. Both handles just up on the hip, good proper position slight flex to the foot and she can easily do her isolated eversion movements. Now, plantar flexion is only one half of the equation. You want to be able to do dorsiflexion, just drop the bar, non-exercising foot on the bar, hands on the shin, now she can pull her toes towards her shin and there's dorsiflexion. We can do dorsiflexion inversion, dorsiflexion eversion. It's as simple as that. Finally, as much as AFX is an excellent strengthening tool, it's also a superior stretching tool. And that's one of the nicest things about it. Part of the reason we use the bungee is because you can get good, safe, long stretches and really increase that range of motion. Because for as much as the foot and ankle is about strength, it should also be about flexibility and range of motion. So thanks very much for your time.